Hello and welcome back to another video on my channel and today I'm going to show you how to run the ball effectively out of the West Coast offense. Now this is going to be a bit of a longer intro so skip to this, uh, this timestamp in the video to watch these setups. First thing that I want to talk about is I'm going to make an ebook out of this West Coast playbook. I've been running it for a, for a whole month now, I think it's a very effective offense. If you want to pass the ball and also if you want to run the ball, a very underrated run place in this offense. Now, the next thing that I want to talk about, and the last thing actually, is I have some wagers planned for the next week. I have another YouTuber that I'm going to wager, I don't know, I'm not sure if you know him, he's called Swift, he has 18k, voice crack, he has 18k subs. And he's a pretty good player. I've watched only a few gameplays of him. He runs split close, so he knows what he's doing. He's passing the ball, so that's going to be a cool game. And also, I've got going to start a wager series with another German streamer. His name is Picolas. He's a nice dude. I've been watching him for, I think that's the second year that I'm watching him. Maybe I've already watched him two years. I don't remember quite exactly. But yeah, he's a cool dude, and this is definitely going to be fun. Also, the third and last thing I'm going to talk about is yes I'm wearing pajamas it's late at night it's about 10 o'clock right now in the evening I did not feel like changing clothes and I wanted to record a video so yeah that's what I'm doing if you don't want to look at my shirt that's fine just look at the screen because I got some fire coming for you now I already recorded this video once once but I did not get the message across that I wanted to get across this is primarily a running formation Okay, it's a running formation. You want to run the ball mostly when you're coming into this form. What formation am I talking about? I'm of course talking about the far formation. Not just not any far formation. The far tight slot formation. I'm going to roll a clip of Young Kiff running this formation to perfection right now and then you'll see how good this formation is. Roll it. That's really all there is to it. He was getting outran by Dante Hall in cover two and he just left it. First and ten, Moss up the middle. He's got a Let's lot go. of room inside the 40. Sort of move. Come oh, on. it's Randy. It's Dandy. He's into the end zone. And Young Kim, after being down 21-7, has just rattled off three unanswered touchdowns. So I think you get the message. It is a good running formation. Now, what play did he what play exactly did he run? He ran fullback dive. Now, how did he get Randy Moss at fullback? This is th something here. Uh, this is something that is exclusive to mud players. I did a full video on this, so please make sure to check that out. I can't snap with my left hand. There you go. Um, click on the link in the top right corner to follow the link to get to the video where I explain this in more detail. Basically, what you what you want to do in your uh, in your mud lineup, you only want to have one halfback on your whole lineup. You don't want any fullbacks. Put a uh, tight end in that fullback and also only have one quarterback don't sub in a backup quarterback don't have a backup quarterback on your uh, entire mud lineup to be exact and then you when you come to this formation you just flip the right stick to the right three times so that's one two three you're now in the dual halfback set and then you have a, you should have a wide receiver in that fullback now what you're going to do once you call this play it's fullback dive and we're just going to come out in yeah, the heck. I'll just I'll come out in Overstone Brave. No, that's not the setup. Oops, excuse me. There you go. And now what you want to do is you want to flick the right stick to the right one time. One time to the right, that takes around left and he gets a faster animation. That's only of course if you have a right handed quarterback. If you have a left handed quarterback, just leave it as is. If, a left, if you leave it as is, it's going to turn, his, the quarterback is going to turn around to the left. If you flip it by uh, flipping the right stick to the right, he's going to turn around to the right side. Now, you get faster animations with a right-handed quarterback if you turn to the right, and vice versa with a left-handed quarterback. If he turns to the left, he's going to hand the ball off to the running back a lot quicker. I'm only going to throw this one at you a couple of times because I don't think it is that... Uh, like interesting and informative compared to the passing place I'm going to show you is I'm only going to run one more time just to show you that it is quite a good run 
if you have a faster plane, or of course if you get someone like Devin Hester in there, that's going to be really, really, really glitchy. So definitely do that. Get a fast receiver in at halfback and just torch your opponent. Okay, so if they can somehow stop your run and you don't want to pass still out of the summation, there are three plays you can do this with very effectively. The first play, I'm just going to select it right here, is going to be Z corner X cross. This is also going to be our audibles. I'm going to show you my audibles now. Instead of in, uh, instead of X spot, it's going to be Z corner X cross. I want to put in half back a uh, full back dive instead of half back dive. So I'm going to press triangle and then square to put in full back dive. Bench switch is fine and flats. No, not bench switch. Is it, is it fine? Yeah, it is fine. Sorry, I have not been running this formation a ton. I've just lapped it up a little bit, a little bit, because mostly when I run this formation, I only run the ball because it's that effective. But if you want to pass the ball, there are also some setups. So I don't remember quite. So I don't quite remember the names of the plays yet. Okay, bench switch is fine. Now we're going to come out in Z corner X cross, and this is going to beat cover three very effectively. Now I'm going to come out in a three four odd cover three. And all we're going to do is we're going to streak dicks, which is triangle, square, and then the left stick up for a streak. There you go. And block my right halfback, my fullback in this case, which is triangle, R1, R2. So Then I'm going to motion out cook, and that's the whole setup. It's going to get open very, very easily and very consistently. Just watch this corner out eat. It's a very, very effective play against cover three. So if... Some, uh, somehow he gets a cover three to stop your play come out in this do these setups there you go it's that simple and you can also no, that's not what I wanted to show you something that you can also do is just if you I'm going to just right here yeah if the flats do not get covered you can also throw this ball to cook and he's going to get a good animation not right there and he's going to get a good animation up the field to get some yards for your offense if your opponent uses the corner route you can then also try to throw the in route it's not as open as it should have been because he didn't use it the corner route obviously but if he does that then go back to the in route that's all I have for this play for beating cover 3 you go to C corner X cross to beat cover three now I'm going to move the ball over to the right hash mark because we want the uh, tight the two wide receivers to be to the wide side of the field versus cover two I'm going to audible to a cover two here and we're going to now beat and attack Tampa two bench switch is going to be the play all we're going to do is we're going to streak circle and block r1 that's all we need we can also motion him out and do something like this or an out route that's only if you want to make sure to suck down the cloud flat. That's what she said. No, that's what he said, rather. Okay. I got kind of messed up right here, and I did not make the read. So, let me show you how, how open this gets. Just by max protecting. That's good enough, too. And he's just wide open. That's against a cover, too. If this gets user. The thing that I would then throw is the a uh, little check down to X. No, that's not it. There you go. Yeah. If this gets used, then I would just simply throw to X. It's just it's a nice stop route. It stops in a tender area. Just throw that and get your tight end the ball. Make sure to have a fast tight end, and then you can maybe still get like seven eight yards on a little check down. This is to beat cover 2. We're now going to go get into how you can run a very, very effective crossing route out of this formation. Alright, so the last play that I want to show you guys is the play called Flats. I've shown you C-Corn X cross. I've shown you bench switch. Fullback dive I've shown you. Now we're going to get into the last audible. And I'm going to explain you what you can do in this play to make it effective. First thing is we're going to hitch Stefan Dix. That's going to be our check down. That's triangle, square, R2. Then we're going to block our left halfback. In this case, Cook. Then rem remember, in ultimate team, we're going to have a wide receiver in at this spot. 
and we're going to motion our wide receiver in this case halfback out and streak him he's going to be our clear out guy and the last thing is we're going to uh, flat x which is triangle x and then l2 if you're on xbox that's y a right tr left trigger there you go and this is just going to get open very very easily all I'm reading is I'm reading be between the crosser. Oh, I didn't, got I didn't got time there. Yeah, shoot. He shattered me. That's gonna happen occasionally. That's how this game is sometimes. You just get shattered. Not a biggie though, because I'm going to do the same thing again. And it should be open uh, by, a, by a margin. There you go. An easy, easy, easy completion now again. Even though the 49ers do have some good linebackers and do have good run defense, they don't really have anybody except for Richard Sherman. So maybe if they get like a... Oh, never mind. He's actually on the right side. So th this play, this play, this play works incredibly well against even one of the best defenses in regular teams. Once again, the setup. Hitch, tr uh, square, block, left halfback, streak this guy, motion him out, and then flat this guy. It's a very, very simple read, trust me. It's not that hard of a read to make. And in case the um, the crossing is users, just throw the hitch. It's a very, very, very effective check down for you to use. I guess I'm kind of like throwing around some random words. But I guess you, un I hope you understand what I'm saying. A lot of this uh, formation revolves around running. And if you can, three setups that are very, very effective. And shows some different looks, some different motions. I don't think your opponent has, has, has ever seen these setups. So he's going to be caught by surprise if he thinks you're going to run the ball because you've running, been running the ball up and down the field with your wide receiver in a halfback. He's not going to be ready to cover just such simple but yet effective route combos. So this formation doesn't have great passing plays, just stand alone. But it has a great running play. And it's very easy to run the ball of this formation, uh, accompanied by some great passing plays. Once again, either he's using it or he's not using it. In case he's not using it, just throw the cr crossing out. Just please do it. And pause. And see for yourself how effective it is. That's all I have for you today. This is the first part, except for the gun bunch plays that I've already shown on this channel. Of my West Coast ebook is going to be completely free. Also, I'm going to drop this in a written format after I've done every video on every formation that I want to do. If you hit the subscribe button, I would greatly appreciate it. And also, make sure to tell me in the comments which formation you want to see me go over next. Thanks a lot for watching. Make sure to run the ball in Madden 20. Peace out. Truth for some robbers, and he's playing Batman. Fed, he's gonna rob him. Yeah. I got the Glock in my robbery. 17 shots, no 38. Yeah, I got the Glock in my robbery. 17.